Okay. I'm on my bed. I'm going to do a random read. And it was funny because I was checking something and it was like they brought me right to Lulu. They do that every once in a while. <clears throat> and the first thing I heard out of her mouth, because I, I was just kind of like, it's, here's the thing. I didn't even like click on it. So it, it kind of clicked me like in the very beginning. And all I heard her say is like, yeah, I ran into like an Alyssa. And I was like, oh, I know an Alyssa. <laughs> and I, and I haven't, um, read into it. And it was funny because then I was like, let's do a random read. I don't normally do random reads. I got the goosebumps. So I'm sitting in bed trying to relax, getting last minute confirmation numbers and stuff for the little vacay. And I'm just like, oh, I'm like random, random. Maybe they're sending me back to Lulu. I don't know. I don't really watch other readers, guys, so and I don't really know what that's about, all about. I think it's just talking about, like, I don't know. I'll figure that out. But anywho, random, okay? We got the master. So this is releasing fear, releasing negativity. This is also having the freedom, okay? It's also the devil, but... So what this is saying to me is like, you, you feel like nothing's flowing right. But here's the thing. It's like, you're blocking your own heart chakra. Someone is, okay? And it's like, it's like not allowing yourself to like, feel this, okay? Um, It's your own blockage. I feel like you're dealing with somebody who's got a black belt. Is that the highest belt you can have? Even though they definitely wouldn't have metal in karate. But that was like a big, big message. It also just took me back in the day of like slavery. Not because it's black. It's the way it's knotted. I don't like that. To me, that's like... It's just pain. It's almost like past pain. It's like you're almost dealing with like a past life regression pain. The feeling of you feeling trapped. You know what I mean, Jelly Beans? Temperance, balance. It's the yin and the yang, though, guys. Okay, it's like right here is hurting on me. I don't know what that's all about, but it's temperance, guys. Okay, it's like not trying to dominate certain situations, letting things flow. Um, renewed energy, healing energy. You know, ask spirit what it is you want to bring to the table. You know, what is it What is it you need help with? Is it just healing? Is it balance? Is it, you know, your senses? I've been feeling these senses, man. You know, but it's like structure, discipline. So it, it's working on what needs to be worked on for sure, especially if somebody feels like, you know, again, it's like, it is the devil. So it's like, but to me, it's, it's, it's fear based stuff. So it's like, if you release that toxicity, that devilish, whatever it is, you know, it's like, it's like a newfound freedom, like love, you know, it's time to heal. It's time to mend. 
embrace, you know, um, it, it is the world. So it's basically saying, you, you know, you want to feel whole, but you, you not. Okay. Um, it's like, how can you feel grace, graceful or grateful when you're in this energy of like unbalanced energy, you know, it, it's, I don't know. It's, <sighs> It's also the law of attraction, you know, and like being able to reach what you want to reach and your dreams and achieving it, you know, so it's like embrace it. But here's the deal. It's it's six and then it's five and then it's three. But what I'm looking at is five, four, three. So it's like you gotta like get out of this. But again, it's like the heart of the issue, okay, so, so listen to me, like, this is the heart chakra, even though it's the devil, but it's like, nah, I'm not gonna let nobody in, we're focused on the heart chakra, okay, here, tree of life, but look at the heart chakra, okay, so that's why I focus more on the heart, knowing it's the devil, but to me, it, is, it speaks of fear, okay, so it's like, balancing out these energies, embracing, letting go what no longer serves you, someone's trying to keep their heart trapped, someone's either trying to trap somebody in a situation where you're only, you're only gonna love me, you're never gonna find anyone better, you're in something toxic like that, or it's just your heart is broken right now because of, of whatever happened, and it's time to heal and embrace something new, because once you have to end, but again, what it's telling me too, is some people are in the situation where it's like, there's no way I'm gonna open my heart chakra, you know, because they obviously, if they do that, then they have to focus on healing something, Thing. And it's like a lot of people relate that to fear and they don't want to and then their ego gets in the way. So it's like you're blocking your own healing process when it's like it's the world. It's like knock it off. You know, um, it's, it's time to embrace it. You're feeling it. Embrace it. You got, you got three cards pointing right to the damn hat. You know, so it's like your emotion, the emotion, emotion, feelings, they're here. You know, it's like, has it been broken in the past? Could it be related to past life? Possibly. Can you balance it out? Can you master something? Can you master the fact that your heart is feeling something? You know, so it's like, it's, it's time to embrace what it is this group is feeling. It's all about embracing it. Okay, looking at something new, a new vitality, color, a new discovery, you know, allowing this love to flow. Okay. So one more message. So this was important for somebody, you know, um, it's the magician. So it's like manifesting, you know, this card really is about manifesting. So it's like the power's in your hands. It's like everyone's born with that magic, but yet people are afraid to use it. You know, it's what they want you to focus on is is maybe clarity. You need to give someone clarity or the magic that you have that you don't use or, you know, time to do what you know is is best. It's the power of righteousness too, okay? So it's determine what's best for you and move forward. It's time to create something new. You have the world here. Let the door close. <clears throat> it's time to entertain something new. Look how magical it could be. It's like you're the magician, you know. Let it, let this flow. Okay, there's some big fear. There's some big fear here. But <laughs> I'm like, there's some big fear. It's okay. Let the fear go, you know. Like, be fearless. It's easier said than done, but, you know, I almost went to go, like, hit a button on the fish, but there's no button on it. <laughs> I don't know if somebody has those fishes where you hit a button and the tail starts flapping. It's like, be free, you know, like, it was my mom's first fish she ever caught. My dad was proud of her. Everybody has their ups and downs, guys. Figure out a way how to fix it and create something new with whatever it is that's happening in your life right now. Okay? You have it in you. Set the magic free. Magical shit will happen. Let the magical shit happen. I love you guys. Have a fantastic rest of your day, okay? Bye, guys. Have a great weekend.